The royal colonization carried out by Przemysl Ottokar II led in the second half of the 13th century to the establishment of Landskron, which later became the economic center of the extensive Landskron Landsberg domain. Among the historical figures associated with Landskron are Václav II, Zavish of Falkenstein, and the Archbishop and Chancellor to Charles IV, Petr Jelito, who founded a monastery in the town for the monks of the Canon of St. Augustine. The monastery was later rebuilt as a Renaissance chateau. Over time, the town became the property of several noble families, the Kosteks of Postupice, the Pernsteins, the Herzans of Harasov, and from 1622, the Lichtensteins. Lanschgrohn's most famous son was the 17th century physicist, mathematician, astronomer, doctor, philosopher, Charles University rector and founder of spectroscopy Jan Marek Marci, who gives his name not only to Lanschgrohn's main square but also one of the craters on the dark side of the moon. The town's regular square with its unique Renaissance town hall in the middle survives in its original form since the Middle Ages. The town hall was built between 1581 and 1582. Following the Thirty Years' War, the town began to be dominated by German settlers. The town's administrators were German and the town chronicle was written in German. At the same time, however, from the Middle Ages on, the historic Bohemian-Moravian border went through the Landskron region. At the end of the 18th century, Landskron was declared a municipal town, and in the 19th century it became the headquarters of the regional governorship and courts, and until 1960 it was the administrative centre of the district.